Hi everyone, I'm Heba and welcome back to my channel. Today I'd like to show you the products that I've used up for the month of November and to let you know if if I if I'll buy it again or if they were kind of mm, you know. <laughs> but anywho, well let's get right down to it. Now the first product that I finished is two of them. It's a shampoo and conditioner, and they were in my empties before, and it's by Regenerous, Regenesis, and it is their thickening shampoo and conditioner. And I really like this. I do feel that it does make my hair feel a little bit fuller. And this is my go-to. I, I am using others, but I haven't finished those yet because I, I like these more. So I finished this faster, I guess you could say. And I'm still, you know, trying to accept that my hair has been falling out. And it is what it is. Menopause. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, I usually buy these from Derm Store or LovelySkin.com because they have sales and this is pricey. This is $34 and $36. $34 for this shampoo and $36 for the conditioner. And when they have 20 or 25% off, that's when I buy them and that's when I stock up. So yes, this will always be in my shower. So yes. <laughs> Another thing that's in my shower is my Moonlit Path. This is my favorite scent. So I have the shower gel, I have the lotion, and this is the sugar scrub. So yes, again, I have a stock pile of this in my drawer. <laughs> because when they have their own sale, that's when I buy it. And so yes, it's I'll always buy I'll always be buying this. I just love this scent. It just this has been my go-to scent. I just love this scent. I've been using this for years, so no need to stop it now. The other shower gel that I also love, I have two. Actually, I have three. The two I, I use the most, and then there's one by L'Occitane, the almond one, but I haven't finished that one yet. But this one, I finished this one again. This is the Brazilian, the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Foreplay uh, Shower Cream. And I love the smell, too. I just love it. Mm. And of course, during the Sephora sale, I bought several of these actually. So I'll have enough to last me through, hopefully, <laughs> through the next year. <laughs> so yes, I really do like the shower gel. I love the Moonlit Path. I love the Boom Boom Cream. And I'm starting to like the L'Occitane, the almond. I think it's the almond. I know it's an almond scent because I love almond. So yes. And another thing from the Brazilian Boom Boom Cream is their little travel size lotion. And it's a great size, you know, to travel with, you know, put in your carry-on and whatnot, but what can I say? What can I say? <laughs> now another thing, boy, it's mostly shower stuff here. And another thing that's in my shower, this is by Indy Lee and it is the Coconut Citrus Scrub. I really like this. And I want to say Derm Store also carries this, and I want to buy it when it's on sale. I mean, I think that's the best way to buy it. Because you know, you know products are going to go on sale, so that's when I will buy them. That's how I am. <laughs> but I like this because it comes with a scoop, so I'm going to keep the scoop to use it for other shower products. And... I just love the coconut and the lemon scent. It just, and it feels so good. I use a glycolic, a glycolic lotion on my arm, so this is a great scrub to, you know, exfoliate the dead skin off. Also the Moonlight Path one too. I like to use this scent when I use the Brazilian, the Brazilian Boom Boom shower gel. So I kind of mix and match, depending on how I feel. <laughs> But yes, so when it comes on sale, I will be buying this one again. Okay, next. Wow, I have another shower item here. And this one's by Herbivore, and it is their Cocoa Rose. It fell and it broke. This one, I think, was in a, like, a sampler kit. And I already bought the big one, I think, last month when it was on sale because that's when I like to buy things on sale. Unless I really need it, and I know it doesn't go on sale, then I'll buy it. But this one's another good brand that I like. They use natural products. It's an indie brand. 
uh, cruelty-free, uh, sulfate-free, paraben-free, all, all that good stuff. And my husband uses this one too. <laughs> he likes this one. And I use this one whenever I'll use the Moonlight Path because they have a similar kind of scent. Yeah, I like using different things and, you know, to try new things. And if I like it, I'll get it. And if I don't, eh, at least I tried it. But this one, I like it and I did get it. And my husband uses this one too, so yes. Okay, let's see here. And I finished the package of the Shiseido Facial Cotton. And I picked up a couple of these during the Sephora VIB sale. This is what I use to take uh, my eye makeup off. I'll get some micellar water and put it on the cotton pads and just kind of put it on my eyes. And that's that really does help get rid of my eye makeup. And then I'll do my first cleanse and second cleanse and whatnot. I like those cotton pads. They, they are soft. They don't tug or they don't peel, I guess you could say. You know, tear apart. So yes, I like that one. And this micellar water here that I finished up, it is by Biotherm, and it is their Biosource micellar water. This one was not my favorite. I believe I got this, I bought the Essence to go with this, and I think I needed an item or two to get the free shipping, so I went ahead and tried this one. Mm, this one's not my favorite. I didn't feel like it got my makeup off, my eye makeup off as well. I had to go in twice with this product so this one I will not be buying. I do like the L'Oreal one and the Bioderma one so those are always going to be in my my drawers but you know I'd like to try new stuff to see if it worked and this one no sorry <laughs> all right and I've got some facial sprays ugh, facial sprays here and this one's by Mario Mario Badescu oh I can't speak and this is their facial spray with alloy, herbs, and rose water. I've been using this for years also, and and a bottle like this costs twelve, uh, what, seven dollars. And you just spray it on. It's great to you know give you a little refresher on your face. It's great to set your makeup. It's great to even mist your brush if you want to, uh, you know, wet your shadow before you put it on your eye. And I have backups of this. I'm hoping to get some for Christmas. <laughs> this this is a great stocking stuffer. I mean, for the, for the price, $7, this is really great. And it smells really nice. You know, smells like roses. And yes, I will be buying this one again. Another spray, this is by May Lens from Skin. And I love her products. I, really, I love her mask. But this one, this is the Jasmine Garden. It's a botanical facial spray. And it smells, you know, like jasmine. It smells wonderful, but this one just didn't do it for me. This one, you know, I sprayed on my face and I don't know. I do like the scent, but for the price of this one, this one's $70 compared to this one as seven. Yes, she does use all natural products. She makes it all fresh, you know, in her warehouse or in her kitchen, pretty much. But... For the price, I'd rather get this one instead of get this one and just use the money for her mask. I absolutely adore her honey mask. The honey mud, oh my gosh. But this one, I'm sorry, but this one didn't do it for me either. I mean, don't get me wrong, I really like her products, but this one, yeah, so I won't be buying this one again. I will be buying her other products, that for sure. Mm-hmm. And then this one here, this is another rose water. My husband and I, we went to Italy in March and we saw this one. This is the Aqua de Rose and it is by Maria Novella in Frianzi. There's the bottle. And we saw this in Italy and we grabbed two bottles to take with this. We're using the other one now and it, we also got a spray so this one didn't have the spray. This one's just like a regular, you know, you just dump it out and put it all over your face, like an essence. And I like the spray instead of the tonic because I could use this one. This one and the Mario Badescu I use first thing for my skincare routine. I spray on the rose water and then I'll put my essences, essences, and then I'll put my skincare. 
And this one, my husband uses this one too. He uses this one too. And I'm trying to find this one online. I am. Because once we finish that bottle, we're kind of out of luck. <laughs> but, I mean, we've got the Mario Badescu, so I'll always use that one. But, you know, it was something fun when you're in Italy and you want to try something that's made there, for there, that you could find there and bring it home. So if I go to Italy again, I will be buying this again. So, yes, hopefully soon. Who knows? <laughs> All right, here. Let's see here. Let's do this one. This is the Ordinary Caffeine Solution 5%. This one I absolutely love. And this costs $6.70. This one ounce bottle costs $6.70. I already bought another one and I'm using this one. This one, you know, caffeine, it reduces the puffiness. And I really like this. And I use this in conjunction, in conjunction with my Biosense. Uh, their squalene and peptide eye gel that I love. I use those two together and I really like how it looks underneath my eyes. I mean, don't get me wrong, I know I have the wrinkles there, but I really think it has helped the puffiness in my eyes. And maybe my eyes aren't as dark as before. I mean, they're, they're always going to be that, that darkness underneath my eyes. That's just hereditary. But I really like this, and for $6.70, you can't go wrong with this. And you get one ounce, and this lasts me a good six months. Yes, six months. All you need is just one drop, you know, put it between your fingers, and then just dab. And I even use this on over on my eyelid. So I really like this. I really like this brand. There's some products from the Ordinary brand that I really like. And for the price, you can't go wrong with it. So yes, I already am using another one. Another thing that I finished is by Benefit and it is their Precisely My Brow Eye Pencil. And this is in the shade number four. And I wanted to buy it in the VIB Rouge sale, but I thought that they stopped making it. But no, they were just sold out and I found it at Nordstrom and I just got it last week. So I was so glad because I had a number three and it wasn't as dark as the number four that I like. So yes, I do have a backup of this. I do. I am using one now and I even bought a backup. <laughs> Another thing by Benefit, it is their Stay Don't Stray eyeshadow primer. And I bought this during the VIB Rouge sale and I like this. I put this on my eye, on my eyelids, and I will set it with an eyeshadow, you know, just a, just a eyeshadow powder you know, just my skin tone. And I like this. I feel that my shadows do not crease and my eyeshadow does stay on for pretty much the whole day. And I like this one. This one doesn't irritate my eyes. There was one that I tried, I want to say it was a Too Faced. That one, it made my eye tear up. But this one, this one was nice on my eyes and I really like this. So yes. All right, now two things here. They're like deluxe sample sizes. And I had the big products of these, and I wanted to show you the things that I finished. And this is by Fresh. This is the Vitamin Nectar Vitamin C Mask. And this is by Pharmacy, and this is their Honey Mask. So I got these, I think also in a kit, probably in the same kit that I got the Bum Bum Cream, the lotion in. And I finished this, and this is a great travel size. And what I did, or what I'm going to do, is I'm going to rinse these out, and I'm going to use these, reuse them again, because I, I have the big size of this one, so whenever I travel, I want to take some masks with me. And this one's a good size to take, and just, you know, put some, scoop some in my big jar, and put it in here. And the same with this one. So, yes, I do have the big size, and I do like these. Alright, now the next, again, the last things that I always show are my sheet masks. These are the ones that I finished. I finished the pharmacy one. You know, again, I won't go through all of these. I'll just show you the main ones, the Sephora brand, the Shiseido, the Retina, the Retinol ones. These are really nice with the eye, eye mask there too. And, you know, these were like a dollar from, I go to this area in Dallas, a Korea, Korean area, and I pick up these masks. A dollar, 
dollar, dollar fifty, two dollars, and I really like these. These are really nice. And of course, this one I picked up in Sephora. This one's nice. It's cute. <laughs> it doesn't smell like pumpkin. This one does not smell like pumpkin to me, even though it's a pumpkin 24 gold mask. But I like how it looks, and it doesn't bother me that it doesn't smell like pumpkin. I mean, that's, that's all right. And this one by Dr. Jart, I like this one. This one came in that uh, tarot of masks. I think it came in seven, seven masks in that one, and I really like this one. So whenever I go down on my mask, I'll be buying some more. And this one here, I picked up, it's by Star Skin, and this one is a rinse off mask. This one, it, it silk mud, pink French clay. You put it on and you rinse it off after you, you take it off. And it kind of hardened on my face. And you need to be careful where you put it because it will pull on the hairs, <laughs> on the small hairs that I have here. And this one, I broke out a day or two afterwards and I'm thinking it's from this one. So I don't, I don't know if I'll be getting this one again. I do have other masks by this brand, but they're just regular sheet masks, not a mud sheet mask. So we'll see. But anywho, well, those are my sheet masks. I guess those are the products that I finished for the month of November. A lot of shower stuff, <laughs> a lot of sheet masks, and a couple of makeup items. And there are things that I that I already bought and things that I will buy and things that were, mm, that no, that probably not. <laughs> but anywho, thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so you can see more videos like this. And I really appreciate you guys watching. You all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.